hey guys what's up so in this lesson we'll talk about all the revolutions like black green blue orange red etc and like there are very misleading figures but they are asked in a lot of examination upsc ssc other exams and uh, once you are done with this lesson you will remember all the revolutions in one go so this is presented by me roman seni and uh, this lesson will have a long story and you don't need to remember the entire crux of the story but if you visualize it properly then you will be able to remember all the revolutions sab yaad rahega so this is presented by me roman seni and you can rate review and recommend the course here and you can follow me on an academy on this link cool so revolutions when we talk about revolutions uh the first thing first is like uh, blue revolution is fish related to aquaculture so this is very common because blue is the color of water black revolution is related to petroleum production again it's very easy to relate it because petrol is black in color brown revolution it's like both leather as well as cocoa and golden fiber like jute is known as the golden fiber so that is again not big of a confusion golden revolution is fruits slash horticulture horticulture includes everything flowers fruits it's also related to honey production green revolution is the most common one jo sabko pata hoga food grains now fertilizer is related with gray revolution so this is very tricky to remember pink revolution is again very confusing but most sources will say it is for meat round revolution potato since it is round so round revolution silver fiber is related with cotton silver revolution is related with egg poultry production okay and white revolution is dairy operation flood in india yellow revolution is related with oil seeds production now since they are simple colors so it is very difficult to make a mnemonic if you make a mnemonic you will forget it after some time but a story you will never forget so this story is prepared by one of our educator nandini maharaj so i'll be using her content and like i'll just give you an example of how a beautiful story is made and it can be made by anyone within let's say 20 minutes so it is the year 2300 just imagine like 300 years from now the world has run out of petrol and everything has gone down there is blackness everywhere so you can easily relate petrol with blackness here so imagine a dark night which is lit with oil lamps now this is more towards how to make a story and try to visualize visualize it as much as possible now in a secret laboratory scientists have been working hard to find new fuel and they discovered an endless source of oil on the surface of bright yellow sun now it is very easy to relate yellow with sun and it is related with oil seeds so oil seeds is related with bright yellow sun so it's very easy to remember now to reach the sun they fashioned an amazing new spaceship that wouldn't melt all those temperatures although they expect some side effects when the shiny silver spaceship reached the sun it began laying silver eggs so now it is going into the weird zone so when it reached this like spaceship silver it started laying eggs so you can remember eggs poultry is related with silver color but the the astronauts are obviously very very surprised although most eggs fell within the sun they managed to collect some so you don't need to like remember this now let's see they did many experiments on the silver egg but it didn't break in fact it unwound like a fiber of cotton cloth so again like fiber is related with cotton silver fiber or just fiber revolution is related with cotton so like it's very easy to remember now then they wondered if the spaceship behave like this in the seat how will it act in the cold so they went to pluto okay by the time they reached pluto they were very tired they sat down to eat vegetables in the cold gray planet now cold gray is very associated terms so that is how you can remember surprisingly the vegetable begins multiplying so now you have to visualize that the vegetables are multiplying and the atmosphere of gray pluto was acting as a fertilizer for earth foods so that is how even if you remember this story for once if for at least next one year you will not forget these revolutions now one astronomer was very excited about this fact she wanted to know more powers of pluto so since they didn't have any living objects she had a uh, carried a flower golden with golden sunflowers with her so you can remember that golden is related with flowers fruits etc horticulture now she planted one and suddenly the flowers began multiplying and growing the entire planet was soon covered in golden flowers and honey bees started hovering over them so golden is related with flowers fruits horticulture honey etc now they decided to come back to earth with all their exciting discoveries they missed the sight of the blue planet the floods of water brimming with many kinds of fishes so you don't need to like technically remember it because blue is associated with aquaculture or fish moreover they had only carried potatoes on the space mission and they were becoming fat and round eating them so potatoes is related with fat okay and round also and they missed the greens at earth and the variety of food grains they could eat there so like green revolution is related with food grains 
so just remember that like when they reached earth they were served with a brilliant feast and white creamy milk again you don't need to remember the entire story but that's how a story should be made whenever you make for anything in different varieties of meat even the pink duck was on the menu so meat is related with pink but uh, peta grew very angry staged a protest against eating pink duck pink duck meat they had actually come to sell their new products that is fox leather fox leather means which is something like leather but it is not real leather it is made up of brown chocolate and cocoa beans so just remember leather brown and cocoa are the same thing so by the end we are done with this story so you can remember all the revolutions just go through it once or twice don't try to memorize it just like go through it and you will remember all the revolutions anyway if even if you read it like 300 times odds are that you will not remember but if you go through the story then you have a very high chance of remembering them so thank you for watching this lesson have an awesome day